thousands of San Diego Unified School District students are getting ready for their first day of school. They're going to be welcomed back into the classroom tomorrow for the start of a new year. News 8's Allison Royal caught up with several families that are preparing for the big day and all of those COVID-19 protocols. Plenty of kids go back to school on Monday, and that includes kids here at Sequoia Elementary School in Claremont. So you'll need your backpack, your pencils, and you'll also need a mask. The first day of school jitters are in the air. Some San Diegans are nervous, like eighth grader Maya. Feeling a little bit nervous, but I'm excited, especially because uh, we've been online for a long time. Others are excited, like Scarlett and her mom. She's starting fifth grade. We're excited, ready to go, I guess. San Diego Unified announced Thursday that masks will be required both indoors and outdoors, except for physical education and eating. It seems fine to me. It's to keep everybody safe. Getting kind of tired of wearing these masks. San Diego Unified School District Board President Richard Barrera said last week that the district is following California guidelines. Adults will be wearing masks all day. It's not just masks. San Diego Unified said it has upgraded its HVAC filtration systems, added hand washing stations, and upped its cleaning protocols. Teachers are either required to get vaccinated or get tested regularly for COVID-19. So whatever the school and the district says to do, we, we must follow for their protection. One student getting ready for second grade is Carter. His favorite subject? Math. Ah. He's even familiar with the district's safety measures. At the social distance. While Carter is going back to school in person, there is a virtual option for families that are more comfortable with it. And one elementary school will have a special visitor on Monday. State Superintendent Tony Thurman will be visiting Marshall Elementary School on Monday. I'm